Thing. So today I'm going to be doing an at-home workout before I do. I want to get some coffee and start my day. Get some breakfast. Yes. What's up ladies? So I love this workout because whenever I'm short on time and I got to get in a workout that just hits every major muscle group in your body this is the exercises that i do and the first one is a forward lunge i do four sets of 20 repetitions and i'm alternating from right to left making sure the back knee goes directly down into the floor and squeezing the glutes on the way back up the second exercise is a pop squat around the world and i do anywhere from 15 to 20 pop squats I time them and do one minute intervals, four sets, and take a 30 second break in between sets. This one is really good for inner and outer thighs. The third exercise is a side squat step with a delt back fly. And if you have bands, it's really good because it gives an added resistance. If you don't, don't worry about it. It is optional. And again, I'm doing four sets, one minute intervals with a 30 second break in between sets. The fourth exercise is a kettlebell swing. I do not have any weights in the house. Um, so I am just going through the actual form and motion which you'll still get a really good cardiovascular workout with this. I do four sets of 20 rep repetitions and I take a 30 second break in between each set. So my fifth exercise is a karate punch squat. And again, this is great cardiovascular uh, exercises it'll get your heart rate up and you'll burn tons of fat and tons of calories with this um, just make sure that you squat back as low as you can and use as much resistance punching forward so this one again you can use bands or without if you don't have bands just pick up anything heavy in your house it could be a water bottle and use those to press an overhead press into a squat so all you're doing is coming down to a squat and then going right up into an overhead press. And I'm doing four sets, one minute intervals with a 30 second break. So the seventh exercise is my squat. And this is just a simple air squat but just really focus on form here. Pretend that you're sitting back into a chair, go as low as you can with the squat, sitting into the heels and keeping the core strong. I do 20 repetitions and I do anywhere from three to four sets, but usually about now I'm getting tired and this is getting toward the end of the workout. So I'm doing a girly push-up. You're welcome to do the full-on push-ups, um, but right about now I'm getting fatigued and tiring out. So I will do the knees on the mat, so supported knee push-ups. And I'm just trying to lower my upper body as close to the mat as I can before pressing back up. And again, I'm doing four sets of these. So this one is really great to hit every angle of the arm. You're going to get bicep, tricep, and shoulders all in one move. And um, if you have bands, great. If not, just use a, a water bottle or anything heavy that you can pick up in the house. You're gonna be going bicep curl, shoulder press, tricep extension, and then back down to bicep curl, shoulder press, and tricep extension. So your final exercise 
uh, would be your crunches. And this is just a basic crunch, but you have to keep those elbows down and chin facing the ceiling, trying to lift the shoulder blades off the mat and squeezing the abdominals. Yeah.